Hello everyone, welcome to Aurelia's Crafting Ideas. I am making floral arrangements for Halloween and I thought that you may want to see what I'm doing. For my floral arrangements, I have decided to use these. I found these at Walmart. This is a skull picture. Look at this. Isn't that neat? I like it. It is quite tall. It's about 8 inches high. And it was $4.74. I like it. And then I found this one too. This one here is a mug. Look. It, no, the set coordinates. And it was $1.87. And it's called a Skull Beer Mug. The flowers I'm using are these. I found this purple bouquet at Dollar Tree. I want to use the leaves and look at this. If you have not noticed this, look, look at this leaf. It is shaped like a bat. Isn't that neat? I want to use this in my arrangement. So I picked up a couple of these uh, purple ones. And then I also picked up the red bouquet. And then the red bouquets come with black skulls. And I want to use the black skulls in the arrangement. And I will also well be using probably the foliage off of here. But look at that, how nice. And then I have some orange flowers. I think this might be a carnation. Look at that. I love the colors on that. It goes from like a, a deep orange to light orange on top. And then I also have this rose here. That is really pretty, right? It goes from like a, a yellow to like a peach tone and all the way to orange. It is very pretty. And then these are from Hobby Lobby. From the Dollar Tree, I also have this one. Look at that. It's a really cute uh, Black Eyed Susan. And it starts light in the center and works to a dark shade. Really pretty. The first thing I want to do is push some moss in here. The container's a little uh, kind of see-through, so I don't want all the picks and the foam coming through, so I think this will help. Get that. And I'm just going to make sure it kind of like overflows a little bit, something like that. And then I do have my floral. And I'm just going to tuck this in here. Get it in there. So, so I don't want to see the, the, the foam. So let me add some more of the moss. And check it all the way around. I think we're pretty good. There we go. I'm going to do the same thing with this the cup. Get some moss. And then I just cut my foam to size and tuck this in here. There we go. So you see, you don't see the green. There's a little bit on the back, but that's okay. I think that the floral will cover the back. So I'm going to put that one aside. I want to do the large arrangement first. I'm going to start with these uh, Black Eyed Susan because I want a bit of height. So I want to go maybe about there. Now, I need to remove the the leaves so I'm just gonna pop that floral off and then just 
slide all this off I don't need. Now some of my uh, florals are going to need help with the heights and I will um, just put them on longer stems and I'll just push these up right quick and then I'm going to put this one maybe about right there let's see let me move you up a little bit so about right there I think that is that is good and then I'm gonna uh, just kind of separate the flowers like that if I need to add more I will but I think that is good right now and next I want to add these and the same thing I'm gonna just pull all that greenery off okay. I'm gonna tuck this in here
Let's take a look at the floral arrangement. Look at this. Black and orange floral. How cute. I love the my my picture there. It worked really well for this arrangement. Look at that. I put this sparkle spikies in there. Uh, look at that. How nice you can view it from all sides. And I was able to put some tiny skulls everywhere. And then I have my bats. And it tried to position them on the orange floral. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> I like it. I got another one right there. And then I have one up here. Let me move him up a little bit. There we go. It is really cute. I like the way it turned out. I'm quite happy with it. And I hope you guys like that one too. On my mug, I'm going to do a similar arrangement again. Now, I'm going to keep the height a little on the shorter side. I think it'll look better that way. I think it'll look better this way. And get the carnations in here right quick. That and then and put the black eye Susan at the top. Like that and then I'm gonna kind of fill in the space. I'm gonna do sort of the same arrangement I did with the with the pitcher one. You know, I put in my orange floral first. And then go from there. So that's what I have. <laughs> okay, let me move this one. <laughs> A little bit on this side. There we go. I think that's good. And then I'm going to add in my black roses.
Here is my small arrangement in the mug. Look at this. Isn't that cute? I like it. I'm happy with it. Cute. On this one, I took apart those the sparkly bits and uh, spread it around that way. Isn't that neat? I like it. We have the tiny one right there, the one in the mug, and we have the one in the picture. I think they turned out really cute. I am happy with them. I hope you like my floral arrangement for Halloween. I really like the way it turned out. I love all the orange and black, and I like it with a little bit of sparkle in there. I think it gives it just what it needs, right? So cute. Thank you for stopping by. This is Aurelia at Aurelia's Crafting Ideas, and I will see you next time. Whoa, whoa.